plumbing company is moving forward with plans to dump human waste on a farm field in Southern Hillsborough County. We first told you about this several months ago. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson reports the plumbing company has hired an environmental engineer, but some people still think the plan stinks. Chris's Plumbing has a plan to spread 100,000 gallons of human waste on this field. It's a plan they say is environmentally friendly. This was when all of this area was going to be septage. Dale Merriman is the environmental engineer hired by Chris's Plumbing to come up with a plan to dump up to 100,000 gallons a day of human waste on this field. Even he admits it's nasty stuff. The trucks coming in will be offloading uh, the portable toilet material, uh, restaurant grease, you know, the septic uh, tank material. That's all nasty stuff. That's nasty stuff, but it'll be going into the treatment plant. But Merriman tells me his plan now calls for the solids to be separated from the liquids and the liquids to be treated with chlorine. Why not just take it to one of the four county facilities that can process this? <sighs> That's a good question, but one of the big problems is a lot of the facilities don't accept grease. Mariella Smith has been fighting the plan for months. And some of those organisms last in the environment a year. Uh, uh, so, so they can be held in these ponds, and then the day they overflow into the river, they can float down the river and make somebody very sick. Smith lives miles away from the farm where the wastewater will be dumped. But she does live along the Little Manatee River, which she maintains is downstream from the proposed dump site. It's um, precious to all of us who, um, not only those of us who live along the river, but as a county resource, as a state resource. A public hearing on this issue where you can voice your concerns has now been scheduled for November. Jeff Patterson, News Channel 8.